Each year, 30,000 young Americans age out of foster care. 70% say they want to go to college, but only 40% graduate from high school. Only 10% enroll in college, and of those, not even 3% graduate. I grew up in foster care. I went to college. I graduated. I am one of the few. The one main reason why I'm doing so well and so many other foster kids aren't is because I had two supportive adults in my life. The, the hardest part is feeling as if you're disposable. I've had a lot of foster care workers and social workers. I can name two who actually, I, I, I can honestly say, cared about me. As a child, I could not see tomorrow, and it took a couple of angels for me to um, allow me to see that I was worth something. To this day, I don't know what she saw in me. How many kids do you know who could successfully navigate through school on their own? And I just knew that education was kind of the way out. I worked extremely hard um, through high school, through college just so that I can have the opportunity to provide for myself to one day be able to give my children what my mother failed to give me. I said I wanted to go to college and he said you can't do that because he knew my name, my mother's last name, and he knew I was a foster kid and he said you have to do general ed and I said I want to go to college and he filled in my form. He left and I erased it. Loneliness you can experience in college can sometimes be like just short of crippling. I don't have anyone who's going to be really excited or if I you know, get an A or something here and there's no one who's going to care if I get an F. There's... The first summer came around, I was like, oh, what am I going to do? Like three months? Like I have nowhere to live. Too many foster youth end up unemployed, living in poverty, pregnant as teenagers, in juvenile justice as kids in prison as adults. As a foster care youth, we come in at the bottom of the totem pole statistically. If it wasn't for Rutgers, if it wasn't for college, I would, I would be in jail again. A mentor, a scholarship, an internship, any one of these things can help a foster kid succeed. The first rule of thumb is if you wouldn't allow it to happen to you or your child, don't accept it for our children in foster care. We have to change this story. All of us, each of us, can make a difference.